Hello everyone, this is Johnny Crass, and we're going to try um, the first battle report of sorts. Hopefully this will turn out. Um, Empire v. Tomb Kings. So, brief run over, you pretty much know the Empire list, but it's uh, 4 demis, steam tank, 4 demis, uh, 20 swordsmen with a level 4 heavens, who's rolled Ice Shard, Harmonic, uh, Curse of the Midnight Wind, and Comet, so all the good heaven spells. Uh, 30 halberds, BSB with Dragon Helm, or no, not Dragon Helm, uh, just defensive kit, doesn't really matter. Uh, War Altar with the normal kit for him. Uh, another Steam Tank, cleverly disguised as an Iron Blaster. Uh, 10 Inner Circle Knights with Lances and a Musician, and 4 more Demis. Uh, on Tomb Kings, we have a Necrosphinx, uh, 3... Necro Knights, uh, five chariots with a Tomb Prince on chariot, cleverly disguised as a, a War Kitty, uh, five Horse Archers, uh, ten Bowmen, six Ushapti with great weapons, thirty Warriors with sword and board, three chariots, ten Bowmen, three Carrion, and Casket of Souls. All right, um, did we roll for first turn? Yeah. No, we did not. So we'll get back to you with someone else's first turn. All right. All right, coming back to you at the bottom of turn one. Tomb Kings went first. Um, nothing really happened of note. So we just uh, we just kind of glazed over doing it. Um, it was just everyone kind of shuffled up a little bit, threw some dice at magic. Not much happened. Um, Empire. Um... The Iron Blaster, Steam Tank, misfired, lost a few points, nothing bad. And everything just shuffled up a little bit. Um, cannon fired off that Steam Tank, killed one Chariot. Um, cast Ice Shard Blizzard on those Carrion, killed one Carrion because of the lore tribute. And those Demigriffs are going after the Casket of Souls. And everything is, that, is as you can see it. So, until next turn. Uh, bottom of Tomb Kings 2. Um, carry on charge flank a steam tank. No other real charges. Necrosphinx shuffles up here. Um, they all just shuffle up. Oh, by the way, there's a Hyro Titan back there disguised as a tree man. I'm not sure if I mentioned him really. Um, Chariot came back to life. Protection was bubbled over pretty much the entire Tomb King army. And, uh, Casket took the life of one demi chicken, but they passed their panic tests. Um, so, Empire turn next. See you then. Uh, bottom of Empire, bottom of Empire 1, uh, Demigriffs move up more towards that thing. Um, the steam tank misfires again, does a wound to itself, loses a steam point. Um, they charge the Necrosphinx, and everyone else just shovels up like you can see. Magic phase was a double one phase, but managed to get off, uh, the five up ward save prayer which affects the Demigriff and the Steam Tank. Uh, shooting, no shooting. Combat, Steam Tank clears up the Carrion. And it's a push over there. We both deal a wound to each other. So, uh, coming back in, Tomb Kings, turn three. Uh, Tomb Kings, this is three, right? Uh, this is three, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Tomb Kings three. Um... Just some backpedaling, some spells, minus one movement, dangerous terrain, and a bunch of buffs on the Ushapti. Um, horses run out in front of the knights, and then two bow shots take off two knights, of course. Uh, Necro Knights go into the flank of the Demigriffs, and between them and the uh, Necro Sphinx, tear them up, and I break off the board. So he just reforms. Um... And yeah, it's looking like Empire 3. Uh, Empire turn 3. Demigriffs go charge in there. They clean up the casket, and the casket views them as friendly, so it does not blow up and kill any. Um, steam tanks generate some points and rush up to try to block some charges, defend some squishy units. Uh, Demigriffs go into the chariot, clean them up, overrun into the skeletons. Uh, a bunch of prayer buffs get dispelled, but the five up ward goes onto the steam tank, steam tank, knights, and halberds, and of course the altar itself. Um, 
lose a couple swordsmen to the net, and Comet of Casanadora gets dispelled. All right, Tomb King four. Um, bottom of Tomb Kings five or King's four? four. Tomb Kings four. Um, Ushapti charge here. Uh, Necro charges the stank. Knights charge the knights. Um, skeletons try to charge the other stank. Doesn't pass. Um, magic bunch of buffs get tossed around. Speed of light, time warp, falls protection. Um, shooting, not much happens. Uh, combat, snakes chop up a few knights, take a wound in return, knights stick around. Um, Necro and the Stank get in a pillow fight. Over here, Ushapti kind of whiff, and I make a lot of ward saves because of the prayer last turn. So, we actually win by one, but because of Construct, um... Nothing happens. BSB took a wound in the fight, though. And Demigriffs chew up those, uh, a bunch of those skeleton warriors and reform to fight some more. All right, um, Empire turn four coming up. Uh, bottom of Empire four. Um, War Altar just moves up. Steam Tank fails its uh, barrel towards the Hyro Titan. Uh, those Demis push up to try to get back into the game. Uh, magic sees just some prayers tossed around mostly. Uh, combat, knights stick around. Um, the Necro Sphinx puts two more wounds on the steam tank. Steam tank does nothing. Um, Halberds and BSB just continue to beat the Ashopti. <laughs> and um, the Demigriff Knights with Harmonic Convergence eat the rest of the skeletons and reform. Alright, on Tomb Kings 5. Tomb Kings 5, um, things just kind of shuffle around to get out of charge arcs. Skeletons go into the flank of the steam tank. Um, nothing else charges. Uh, magic, don't think anything really happened. The net went off, I see it. Um, yeah, net of Amantok went off. Um, shooting, shooting, not much happened. Uh, combat, combat was a pillow fight over here. Finally brought down a snake. And he killed a knight. Um, another pillow fight over here. My engineer actually dealt a wound to the Necro Sphinx. So, awesome. Um, here, we just continued to beat up Ushapti, though he killed my BSB. Just proof that Ushapti cannot fight their way out of a paper bag. <laughs> and over here, engineer punked one skeleton in the face. And then the skeletons dealt a wound to the steam tank. And now it's Empire turn 5. All right, Empire turn five. Uh, War Altar charges the Hyro Titan. Swordsmen were going to charge, but failed the strength test. Um, Magic Phase got off bubbled uh, Curse of the Midnight Wind. And uh, this combat killed another Ushapti, lost a few dudes. Um, tickle fight between the War Altar and the Titan. Tickle fight between the Stank and the Archers. Um, minor tickle fight over here. Almost killed the tight or almost killed the Sphinx with an Engineer attack, but he made his armor save. And uh, Demigriffs kill all but one Skeleton Archer and just sit there. And those Demigriffs moved up to corner the Hyro Titan. Or the Hierophant. Alright, um, Tomb Kings... Six. Okay, so um, this is end game. We just played through turn six. Um, Tomb King's turn six. He gets uh, enchanted blades or cursed blades off on the Necro Sphinx. He also bubbles out a um, time warp. Uh, no, no, speed of light. Um, Necro Sphinx gets the heroic killing blow on the Stank. Kills it dead. Can't believe it. Um, chariots go in here. It's a big pillow fight. I stick around. The skeletons hold up the steam tank another turn, which was just ridiculous. Um, then uh, halberds kill the Ushapti, as they should have done a long time ago. Uh, they were actually doing fairly well. Um, then my turn. Halberds charge the 
Hire a Titan, um, Demigriffs found a hole because one Demigriff over there died. So the Demigriffs who finished off the casket charged the Hyro, Hierophant, um, and no real other charges. Uh, magic, nothing really in Magic, but a lot of buffs just got shut down. Shooting, what shooting? Uh, combat, so first off, combat over here. Halberds and, uh, well, pretty much I forgot about Thunderstomp and, well, didn't forget, but forgot how bad it was. And we barely, we beat the Titan by one, but because of Construct, it stuck around. Um, then we went over here. The almighty Demigriff, one Demigriff goes into the Hierophant and fails to wound it. It leaves it sitting on, uh, one wound after crumble because the Hierophant, with its one attack, pushes one through on the Demigriff. So that was that was mildly upsetting. It made, it made its <laughs> yeah, made its regen save. Um, over here, Demigriff and Chariots just getting a slap fest. I'm unable to kill the Prince, and Steam Tank uh, clears up those archers. And the Knights v. Necro Knights combat finally ends with the Necro Knights killing all the Knights of the Inner Circle. So we added up the points, and it's a draw. Um, which was pretty well deserved for Tomb Kings, because it was not looking good there for a while. Losing those steam tanks really hurts. Or a steam tank. Yeah, so, hope you enjoy. This is the first battle report of many, hopefully. And goodbye.